Hey guys, let's take a look at number 95, unique binary search tree. Search trees too, uh, we are given an integer. Please generate all structurally unique BSTs. Well, actually this is a follow-up of uh, uh, problem 96 and uh, I've already done that before. Please search on my channel for 96, unique binary search trees. There, it's basically the same problem, but that problem only requires us to return the account the count of the binary trees but here we need to generate all uh the the real trees right so well uh please search on my channel for that detailed explanation there i'll just uh, start on writing on the code writing the code the basic idea is that uh, for a number of n uh, if we want to generate the binary search tree, we need to first determine the root. If we determine the root, root if, if we have chosen the root, we can separate the problem into left part and right part. It's different different string, different numbers, right? And then that could be done uh, iterat iteratively. And uh, we can just uh, then combine these two, a uh, left part and right part, and add and uh, get the permutation of each each of the trees and uh, generate a new tree and push into the result. Uh, right? Yeah. Let's say, let's say the for number n. For each time we generate the uh, binary search tree, there is a, we pick a number. There, so it's generally a range of number with a start and the end, right? So I'll say the generate is a recursion function with start and end. And then uh, the results of this of the binary search trees are kept up, are stored in this result. Just as what did before in 96, 96, we choose the root node. Okay, now we're picking number. It might be one, it might be two, it might be three. So the problem becomes the left part would be left list. If trees because it's a bunch of tree it would be what it would be generate right generate a start from start to i minus one right const right trees It would be a generate generate uh, i plus one n right, and now we get the left part and the right part. Like for three uh, for three here, we get the trees of one and two of three, and then we combine them. So for each that tree that node left node in left trees. For net off, not in, my bad. For let right node of right trees, we will create a new tree. So the new tree will be node middle root would be new tree node i right so it's i and then roots left will be left node root right will be right node and then we could push this root into the result and finally uh, how how would this end? Well, if
like if start is bigger than n, result will push, just return newer, right? And uh, if start is start, then it will be a tree of start newer, newer, newer. So it's okay, it's, it's just like this. And then we can return, generate one and I'm not sure it is right, it should be. If something is wrong, hmm? oh. If something is wrong, it must, must be in this, uh, the ending cases. Huh? Right tree is not iterable. Right trees. Oh, we forgot to return. My bad. If return result. Yeah, it, it seems that I've done this problem like five months ago. Expect empty. Oh, it's newer, so it should be empty. My bad. Hmm? It should be no. Okay. I think it should. It, it, it's right. It should return no. The problem becomes if we input zero, it should be none. If it's zero. Because we start with zero and then add zero. Uh, well, it says start from one, all right? Integer. Give n. Hmm, that is nasty. If n equals zero, we return empty. Wow. Once again, we need to we need to fully understand what the input. If it either is valid or not. Yeah, we're accepted and uh, maybe it's not that bad. And about the time complexity, please refer to my la last last video about 96. Uh, actually, we're using these, this for loop here. And uh, so, It's very complicated about time because it's related to Catalan. Um, let's say we want this is O n right, but it's O n for just each n. Well, it's I think it should it should be it should be just a uh, Catalan. So the time complexity would be Catalan. And and the space will be Catalan, and this is my guess. It might be wrong, man. I'm not sure. I'm not. I don't think the uh, interviewers were asked us to deduct the, the 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 right time complexity here for each. Yeah, we will use. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. So that's all for this problem. Hope it helps. See you next time. Bye-bye.